Hey everyone, welcome to this uh, shortwave radio video. And this is the uh, Texan AN 48X active loop. It's in my window in the kitchen. Little uh, amplifier box is right here with the uh, switch for long wave, medium wave, short wave. And of course this very long wire here that is going right here. Uh, to the radio that I'm here, that's age data. So I'm playing around with it, trying to find uh, how it performs. It's interesting. A little control box right here. This box has uh, amplification, so you can uh, make it uh, maximum, minimum. And here is kind of a tuner. And uh, you, it's very finicky, but you have to find the right spot for whatever frequency you're tuned to. So this is Radio Japan French service out of Madagascar uh, using this loop antenna on the XH Data D808 right now. So uh, it's kind of nice, kind of nice uh, little uh, performance. You gotta be careful where you tune it because for example if I tune it off a little bit here like at this there's this type of noise there's also as you see that music for example isn't supposed to be there so if you tune it off or tune it on the frequency of another strong station it sometimes mixes it in with what you're listening to. It's uh, a little difficult to find the uh, perfect tuning point. But one thing for sure is it works. So to give you an example, to give you an example, if I um, if I uh, turn off the amplifier here, here what happens? It still gets it, but you see that it's not as strong. So the antenna passively actually does work on itself. If no batteries are in, you get some reception from the loop itself and the long wire that's plugged to it. But if I turn on the amplifier immediately you see that it improves the signal so my uh, you know it, it's nice because it actually works when i compare it to the uh, degen 31 ms that i had which was a piece of junk the 31 ms actually performs like this one when it's off this is a 31 ms degen 31 ms it i mean people say it works it doesn't it just is a passive wire it's a piece of junk the 31 ms this one is not a piece of junk, but you'll see when I actually review it. But uh, I've been playing for, with it for about an hour now, as well as the uh, RSPDX. I even plugged it on the RSPDX to see how it performs. And it actually gave me an, an interesting uh, outlook that I didn't think of when I plugged it in. Because of the waterfall, you actually see the peak of the tuning here going through with the interference and everything. So it's kind of interesting. So anyways, I'm continuing to test, and uh, right now I'm receiving Radio Japan, Madagascar, French service. Uh, really cool, on the XH Data D808. So we're continuing to test with the uh, Texan 48X active loop antenna. Et 